Hi, Steve Blythe, uh, J. Ray Sistine, and it seems like just uh, a few weeks ago we did one of these pole stress tests, but we have some new contenders I want to uh, bring to the table that will be coming out here shortly or are already available, but weren't here for the last test. And uh, so the first one I have here in my hand is a 22-foot facelift hybrid. Without brush, it only weighs less than three pounds. And uh, the interesting thing about the facelift is you'll notice that they're all uh, smaller tubes than most of the other contenders. So uh, for it to hold up the way that it has here as a hybrid pole is pretty cool. The next one is the AquaClean 25, one of the most popular selling poles for this year, in 2012, be around for next year. And here we have the uh, Enlight in hybrid. All right, and the Enlight uh, is, is four pounds and the AquaClean is five. So the then next up here is the 31 foot hybrid pole from uh, the three star line. And that's at uh, eight pounds, so it's a little heavier pole. And next here is the glider. We're now we're moving into carbon fiber. So the first, the first carbon fiber is the glider at six pounds, and uh, extended out there at uh, 31 feet. The uh, pole here is the uh, new um, carbon fiber facelift. All right, and again, you can see how small the pole sections are and how much lighter this pole is. This pole is uh, about six and a half pounds plus the brush um, and uh, it holds up really well for being small and as, as lightweight as it, as it is. Then coming up next after that is the carbon fiber version of the three star pole which is right up there stiff along with the, uh, the, other, the other contenders in the stiffness category. They're all very close. This is your, your SLX gardener pole that uh, at uh, 31 feet in the SLX is about uh, six pounds as well. Been out there strong as the, the one, the pole to meet or try to beat for uh, several years now. Um, Enlight uh, came out in carbon fiber at 27 feet um, is, the next, is the next one up. And moving into, as you can see here, the, the, the winners is available to us is the 25 foot extreme and that's at two and a half pounds without the brush and the 31 foot um, extreme at three and a half pounds without the brush um, are just are just st sticking up like they're on some little blue pill and uh, so they're they're obviously uh, a lot stiffer than the poles we did a few weeks ago and uh, we um, the, por the important part to think about here with these poles is when you're when you're working on the building a lot of people like a stiffer pole because they have to put less energy into scrubbing the dirt off the pole so when you're using the pole on the building, moving it from window to window, trying to get it up in the corners, controlling where the brush is, that stiffness factor becomes important. And lightness too. So if you can get a stiff pole and a light pole like the Extreme, okay, you've got both values working for you in that, in that, in that occasion. So um, lightness has its pluses. Right, all, all by its own. So this very light new pole from Facelift is going to be very interesting for the marketplace. And uh, so I hope that this uh, gives you a nice little overview of the, the poles that are available now in most of these and coming out from the manufacturers.